5:30, a brazen jewelry store robbery at a South Florida mall, and the store's owner fights back. It appears the thieves knew exactly what they were going for, and they knew how to work fast. The whole thing taking less than one minute, and one suspect has already been caught. CBS 4's Ted Scouten live at the Coral Ridge Mall in Fort Lauderdale with a closer look at what happened. Ted. Yeah, Rick and Rudy, what a heist. I mean, these guys were really bold. They pulled up the car right here to the front door of Coral Ridge Mall. They parked it there. They got out, went inside just a few steps away, and that's where the heist was in that jewelry store. Thieves run in, a woman runs for her life as crooks with hammers go to work at the Nuri Hallmark and Jewelry Store at Coral Ridge Mall. It was a terrifying heist. All I hear, uh, big boom. Nuri Hassan owns the store. He tells us he just stocked the cases with jewelry for Valentine's Day. He showed us pictures of what was there. Now it's all gone as the crooks smashed the display cases and grabbed what they could, and they knew right where to go. Seems like people been here, like they know exactly what I have. So they target it and, and uh, merchandise where is the big item, big haggy stuff. At one point, one of the robbers was about to leave, but suddenly decides to go back for more, just as a third man casually walks in. This man doesn't even have his face covered. It's around that same time, Hassan said they made a threat. One guy he said, I have a gun, don't do anything, just stay back. That's when Hassan took action, and we see a chair fly across the counter. Then I took the chair. The first thing I tried to protect myself, that I didn't know they were going to pull a gun on me or not, then I threw the chair on him. Not only was jewelry snatched, but there was expensive damage. Watch as one of the crooks bumps his case filled with expensive Yadro statues. The shelves collapse, leaving a heap of broken figurines. 34 seconds after it began, it was all over. The three raced out to a waiting car right at the front door of the mall. Mr. Black, you're charged with robbery with a firearm. Devontae Black was caught just minutes later. Police say he's the guy with the shirt over his face. Detectives said he was in the getaway car with stolen jewelry, a gun, and wearing the same clothes seen in the video. There uh, appeared to be fragments of glass on his pants, as well as rubber gloves uh, in his pocket. As the store is cleaned up, Hassan said he's grateful. Although something like this happened just a year and a half ago, he still feels lucky that no one was hurt. It's like a blessing. It's the thing, really, a blessing nobody got hurt. And those guys got away with about a half a million dollars worth of jewelry. That's the retail cost. Right now, two guys are still on the run. If you have any information that can help investigators find them, give Broward Crime Stoppers a call. That number is 954-493-TIPS. Live in Fort Lauderdale, Ted Scouten, CBS 4 News.